Well, it's terrible now. I mean, this has been going on for two months and we've been basically cut off from uh, getting to the southwest for two months. And it's just a matter of uh, costing us a, a great deal of money at the moment. And Prime Minister has pledged £10 million to help small businesses like this one to recover, get back on their feet. Do you think that's going to be enough? Well, we've been in this business for about 40 years and uh, I don't take up much truck on a politician's pledge, to be quite honest. If he just passes that money over to the local council, we won't see any of it. How reassured are you, though, that he is saying it won't just be for those people whose businesses are actually underwater where there is flooding in their premises? It's also for those businesses, for example, where the footfall is down or like yours, where all of your clients are underwater and therefore you cannot get the business. Does that reassure you some, somewhat? Well, if you can listen to a politician's uh, pledges, yes, but uh, we don't hold out much hope of a politician's pledge. Let's talk about the individual finances then for this company, because you're losing, what, two, three thousand pounds a week at the moment? We think that's what it's costing us on the diversions we've got to take. Um, basically, to get into Devon and Cornwall from here, we've got to do a 25-mile diversion round uh, through Bridgewater to get onto the motorway to go south. And Roger, have you, in all the time that you've worked for Gillard's, ever known anything like this here in Somerset Level? No, I've been here nearly 40 years and I haven't seen anything like this before at all.